Okay. Ah, I forgot to lock my drawers down. But this is what we got going. I got a heat exchanger and I got a collector box. We got to go take care of this in the crawl space. What fun. All right, so here we are in the crawl space. And she's leaking. Where's it leaking from? any leaks well hmm that's strange hmm okay let's get the party started here oh I don't know how that got unplugged must have been backing up pinched up there. Great. That's why it's leaking all over. that it's better than it was that's what happens when you pinch those lines probably have to take this off to Get the gas out. Gas is off. We're going to start taking this thing apart. pads
Which is on. Okay, we are off. Trap. Getting there. We are getting there. Oh, get the burner rack off. Gives me somewhere to grab.
that's it. I think that is it. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Those are the screws that are stripped out. Wow, that cock really, uh, really stuck that on there. See that? That is supposed to come with a collector box. But I cocked it on there. Still was leaking a little. Because those screw holes, those are stripped. Carrier head. Back in 2011, back in 2011, 2012, they had uh, they had problems with the collector box screws. Well, they didn't have like a head on them, like a washer. It just had the the screw head itself without the washer, and it would crack the collector boxes. So there's a bulletin on there, and we changed a whole bunch of collector boxes. Well, they changed the screws, and they put, actually it was, originally it was threaded all the way down. And that solved the problem of cracking collector boxes. But now, I noticed they changed them again to these, it's got a, it's got a washer on there. But it's got this long shoulder and it looks like almost a wood screw. The other ones were machine screws. Kind of look like that. But now they got this wood screw looking thing. And I guarantee we're going to have constant problems with collector boxes on the B series. What I mean by B series is, <clears throat> it's like this is a 59 sc5 b080 the a series would have been a 59 sc5 a080 so now the b series we're getting these funky screws for the collector box i get a feeling we're gonna have problems with them
so that heat exchanger just rides on those rails. And look, it looks like it's pitched. So say if the furnace was sitting upright, that would be pitched. Interesting. Get you up here. And this is all, I gotta change this heat exchanger all because of strip screws. Holy shit. Oh, that's my fingers. Holy crap. Sheesh. Holy crap, what am I missing? Take some time and 
clean the back of this up right here all right so i got the new heat exchanger on there and i'm putting the collector box on and we're using some high temp red So I got a bead all the way around here on the inside. skimp on the screws. Amazing. Oops, I forgot to put this back on. Just not a screw there. But I did get a good seal in there. Just that lip so wide you don't see it squirting out. I need to <clears throat> I think I need to get a microphone for my GoPro I think that's it we're gonna shove her back in the hole shove her back in the hole slide on those rails up got that all cocked in that's on we're good we're good
gonna turn these turbulators down. Towards the drain. So all the water drips down. Not too much to these heat exchangers. These things are cakewalk. Cakewalk compared to the other older heat exchangers. <clears throat> Collector box gasket on. I know it's around here somewhere. You guys hiding from me? Where the heck did I put it? Let me find my gasket. I thought I had it right here. that line up. box screws which not make sense
Hmm. I think too too short. Honestly. too long. <clears throat> oh, my knees are taking a beating today. particular order. See that? Fucking stupid. that one. Wow. I wonder if there's... I wonder if there's a torque spec on this or something. It's really crappy. I'll just tell you that right now. Really crappy. When I can't even put a heat exchanger together without stripping it. I'm not even using the impact driver. Gonna have a bunch of extra screws, believe it or not. The carrier was nice enough to give me extra screws.
not to, not much to wire in it. Not much. Okay, so. In anything? Hmm. Okay, so that's got the gasket on it. Tell you if this thing leaks, I'm gonna fit.
almost back together. there let me get the electrical done all right so <clears throat> electrical's done gas is done and let's, no, i gotta put two screws up there <clears throat> missing two screws on the side